Here's how to run payroll in QuickBooks Advanced Payroll. Before you get started, it's a good idea to check your payroll settings. These include pay schedules, locations, and categories for pay, leave, deductions, and expenses. Now from the Employees tab, go to the top right of the dashboard and select New Pay Run. Then choose the pay schedule from the drop-down menu. If this is your first pay run, you'll get a prompt asking you to select the date your pay period ends. You'll also need to enter the date that your employees will be paid. The next screen shows you the breakdown of PAYE, national insurance, pension payments and so on. The Actions tab runs through the steps you need to take to complete your pay run. You can view reports and payslips here. And you can apply a filter, which is handy if you're dealing with lots of employees. A Warnings tab flags up potential issues. You can turn the warnings off if they're not helpful. When you click Finalise Pay Run, you'll go to a screen which submits your real-time information to HMRC, either manually or automatically. You'll be reminded that you're about to finalise payroll, shown the date that you're paying your employees, and asked to add a date for publishing your payslips. You can download a payment file here too, if you're not using BACS. Click Finalise and the system will export the journal to your QBO account. Under the Reports section, you'll find a wide range of options, including the P32 report, which shows payments due to HMRC, and the Gross to Net report. You can also create report packs here. And that's it. Pay run complete.